everybody. Hi. Welcome. Shinobi. Well, let's just jump right in. <laughs> <laughs> You've probably been here. I don't know what the order of the uploads. Bl uploads. That's, That's right. right. <laughs> yes. I switched it to Japanese because the voice acting is better. Oh, but I wanted to make fun of the shitty English. It's not even like... It's not shitty, but... It's not even so bad it's funny. It's just kind of bland. Yeah. Why, do I, why must I do this? <laughs> Basically. Why must you do this? Because you must. But Big Boss, why? <laughs> because... <laughs> Big Boss Musashi, why? <laughs> uh, the, 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 the chrysalis and, 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 and all that. Yes. You ain't gonna have to do that back foot. <laughs> uh, so this is... I want to say your second favorite next to Tenchu? Uh, so I want to say Tenchu is like literally one of your favorites of all time. I'd say I probably like this better than Tenchu, but they're two completely different games. Like this, Tenchu has sneaking involved. This is just slash things. Yeah. And so the mysterious golden palace has come onto the streets of this Tokyo town. Of Tokyo. <laughs> of Tokyo. <laughs> Live. Hell spawn. We'll believe that. What? Well, we, what? We're we're getting word. Yes, hell spawn. <laughs> there appear, there appear to be a hell spawn on the streets. What's that, Jin? Jim, you say that Shang Tsung has appeared. <laughs> He's holding the card relinquished. <laughs> He's it's a trap card. <laughs> you don't say. <laughs> well, uh, we'll report back to you later, Jim, if you're not dead by the hell spawn. Yugi Moto is has not been reached for comment. <laughs> As he is currently fighting inside the Shadow Realm. Oh, that's a shame, though. He would have been a real good, a real asset. Well, look at all these schmucks. Look at the uh, the clan. And and Nega Shane. What's his, his character's name? Who? Main one, the one, the, the one that's you. Fuck if I remember. We just call him Shinobi. <laughs> Somebody will say his name eventually. Watch it probably be Ryu. Like almost everyone else. Yeah, it's probably like Hosuma or something. Who could forget Ryu? Which Ryu? Yeah. <laughs> what happened to the Aboro clan? I don't know. You gotta get out there. Big Boss moved it to Outer Heaven. We'll be arriving momentarily, don't worry about it. It's not like we'll die. Don't bother, uh, 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 this is my stop. What do you think that mask does for him? <laughs> Why does it need to have four eyes? I, yeah, I don't know, it just looks cool. Like, is he slowly, like, transforming into a spy? Oh no! Brother! Omen! I'm assuming that it's supposed to have different, like, vision settings in it, but I doubt it. God, I love that scarf. Yeah, the most acrobatic character in any game is that scarf. What about Arrow the Acrobat? He's got Acrobat in his name, so it must be good. Nah, that scarf beats him by a long while. Oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> he can't do as many flips and shit as that scarf can. Arrow the ac Acrobat not confirmed for Smash. This is the first time I've ever seen a cutscene that goes slower than the actual game. <laughs> it does. <laughs> it is going very methodically slow. Like, usually the, the cutscenes, like, give you an unrealistic portrayal of what you're gonna play, but this undercuts it. Yeah. <laughs> it's like it's slowly Oh, buffering. you hit us a little. Oh. It's like it's slowly buffering right before its eyes. <laughs> the talisman? It killed my father. Long story short, demon shit, my clan's dead, gotta take revenge. <laughs> Shinobi, Shinobi, lost soul, lost soul, and on revenge, revenge. Like, first stage music, like, for a long time in PlayStation 2 is killed. Like, what do you mean, like, in a good way, or? Huh? In a good way? In a bad way, because, like, sometimes, like, 
stage music like will get me to continue playing the game. Like, first stage music of uh, Beautiful Joe's would make me stop playing it. Really? Yeah. Cause it was so nothing. I mean, I don't really make music really affect me too much in gameplay. If it's good, it because, adds to it. Because but... like the first stage is like tutorial shit that tries to teach you stuff, so obviously it's gonna be slower than the rest of the game. Which makes me it, it, it bores me. If the music if if I don't have enough action to keep me satisfied and the music is boring. I that I can agree with. I mean, if it's solely music, though, that's like saying the tombas move it too slow when the music's going, dun, 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 and it keeps on going with the bells. Tch. I like tombas beginning music. It's all jaunty. It's like you're in a, in a Hawaiian adventure with the whole family. Yep. <laughs> it's demonic tank in attack mode. Yeah, you didn't <laughs> freaking uh, Devil May Cry 2 didn't steal that at all. Which Devil May Cry was that in? Huh? Which Devil May Cry was that in? The bad one. Ah, the one with the uh, bio gorilla bloody. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Defeat bio gorilla bloody on Radical Highway. <laughs> it had one cool boss in it. I wish he wasn't in it. Because That's I will say one game that saved by amazing music yep. is, is the Sonic Adventure series. Mm. Like I I personally like the, the adventure series, but like for people that may not like it, like I could see the music absolutely saving it. That one did not age well. No. Well yeah. The game. I tried playing it like not too long ago. I was like, oh no. Which one? One or two? One. Oh well, one definitely not. Two, I think, has a little bit of a better chance. Yeah. I mean, they don't have the janky like free roam sections. And the awful fucking mouth movements. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, <laughs> why are you a claymation character all of a sudden? What's going on? How did Sega have, have access to Gmod so quickly? <laughs> Gmod before Gmod. Like you're freaking me out right now, Sonic. Oh, uh, how far we've come. You're dead. I got you. You're dead. I'm sorry. Not really. This is for my clan. Are you part of my clan? I'm sorry. So I just talking about music. I've been listening. I don't know why. But that awful, like, Mortal Kombat soundtrack that they released, I guess. What, the movie? Yeah. Oh. Uh. On another note, I wouldn't listen to the Mortal Kombat 3 soundtrack not too long ago. I forgot how much I actually like that soundtrack. It is really good. The best part is, if you have on um, the PlayStation uh, version of Trilogy, you could just pop that sucker right in a CD and just listen to it. Oh, you could do that with basically all the PlayStation, all PlayStation games. Really? Like Tekken 3 and something? Yeah. This is a Bigfoot! Move. Bigfoot the headquarters over! <laughs> don't move, don't move, don't move. <laughs> I love the freaking slash. That's Sonic Adventure 2 boss battle levels. I love oh. the, the slash dash loop. <laughs> if you get a hit, you get an extra dash. <laughs> you <laughs> kill stealing bitch. Leadership of what? Your sword? The Aboro clan, who are all dead now. Don't come close. If I hug you, you might die. <laughs> You were there. You're a part of the clan. What are you even? What are you even talking about? No, her, she released her Sharingan and it blinded her to. Yeah. <laughs> I was about to say, <laughs> when are you gonna go? Never mind. <laughs> but I love you. <laughs> Bye. Oh. You got a Class C license! <laughs> Learn no class time! I don't even know if you can get a damn, uh... S rank? rank? on that fight. I mean, you probably could. You probably gotta root it out and kill more goons. Hatsuma, that's what it is. I was right! I knew it was Hatsuma. Oh. I'm gonna keep on saying Hatsuma.
Take a Kujiki. Take out a Kuji. He's one heartless <laughs> mother. <laughs> Why are you throw it to me like that? He looks like a more badass, like, Raiden from MS2. MGS2. If he looks like anybody, he looks like Andy Bogard. Yeah! And if Andy Bogard and Raiden had their sperm in a genetic tube and Dr. Eggman decided to put it together because he's in those two timelines, you see. I beat you at a duel. I get to be leader. Now I gotta sloppily cut your head off. I love you. You'll see what I mean when I actually fight him. <laughs> I fashioned this scarf out of his blood. <laughs> that would be badass. I put his blood on the windowsill. I let it dry for a couple of days. Look at, and that. This Look at that acrobatic scarf. <laughs> if any tech was amazing in PS2, it's that scarf physics. <laughs> Hurry up and get to uh, Just keep on killing these Yu Gi Oh monsters. That's <laughs> all I can think of. As you slowly try to finish off the relinquish and you save your grandfather, yes. who is also yes. your brother, who is also your lover. <laughs> That's just getting weird. And Exodia is there and he's like, I don't know about this. <laughs> <laughs> I adopted you, son, but uh... I just like the idea of Exodia just going around. <laughs> <laughs> just looking weirded out. Um, uh, he's wearing dude. like a business suit with overalls. He just got back from work and he's like, you know, I, I want to judge your love life, but you know, want to make out with your grandfather, brother? <laughs> that's that's a little much. I think that has to be like a, a recentering. Yeah, is there like. There it is. Oh, there it is. I was about to say. Cause I don't think there's like camera control. Yeah, there is, but it's inverted. Oh. It pisses me off. I hate inverted shit. I always have to change it. Like in Metal Gear, when it has like inverted like aim controls, I always have to bring it back to normal. Like who does that? Who who makes it? In this? I'm not playing a goddamn plane sim. Don't invert the cameras and not let me change it. Star Fox does the same thing where it's like. You, you, you hold up to go down with the R-Wing, and you hold down to go up. Like, we get it. You're trying to be revolutionary. Miyamoto. Oh, well, that's what they do on all, like, playing sim, like, playing games. Yes, because Star Fox is an accurate simulator. This <laughs> is... <laughs> In the near future of 2020, they want it. anthropomorphic it. foxes have arrived. You don't know that. You don't know that. Yeah. It might happen. Be careful on what you try. Jim Ross Peppy. <laughs> <laughs> My god, he's becoming more like his father. <laughs> the R wing is broken in half. <laughs> I can't lock on And Jerry Lawler would be slippy. Ooh, <laughs> <laughs> puppies! Froggies! <laughs> yes, you, you, you did make many of those slippy. But you never became more like your father. <laughs> you didn't know my father. Yeah, he died when you were born. That's how frogs reproduce, don't they? <laughs> I don't think that's right. Shut up. I'm pretty sure you were an embarrassment. <laughs> and then. <laughs> <laughs> and all Peppy has to do is, is, is Fox is Stone Cold and shut up about Stone Cold. <laughs> but somebody's like, what about Wolf? Why do I just have to ruin it? We're about Fox here. <laughs> Listen, we don't talk about that scoundrel. <laughs> that dirty dog. Dirtiest player in the game. <laughs> Wolf the dirtiest player in the No, that'd be Pigma. <laughs> Uh, Got him. We're playing Shinobi. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that? We're still doing like basic first stage shit, so there's nothing really to talk about. I don't know much about Shinobi, that's why. I remember being amazed when I played like one PlayStation Underground demo. And I'm like, this is awesome. And then I never picked it up. Well, because I only rented shit. Well, good thing is, there's nothing really to know. <laughs> Like, it's not, it doesn't have like a long, illustrious story that you need to follow. But love. And butterflies. You could always just not play Nightshade, so. 
Oh yeah, can we do... Well, are we ever gonna play that game, or can we just talk about it? You're gonna hate for the new one as soon as you play it the first time. Oh. Like, it, it looks so over-baked, and like... The second sword that doesn't really do much of anything... But Leon, there's a female. Good for her. <laughs> <laughs> It's breaking the it's breaking the boundaries between male and female ninjutsu. Between male Are you ninjutsu? saying that the male one is better than the female one? You sexist and shinobi. <laughs> Konamichi writes. Can't see anything through this fog. Why you? No, I think I killed the rat one. Hey, brother, look at that. That's that. That's what Hotsuma did. That sloppy ass cut. I wonder who that could be. <laughs> it's it's a mystery. Like, come on, Hotsuma. You got like a big chunk of his shoulder and shit. Like, you could cut his head off straight, like. I don't know why Master the Boss had to put Fox Dive up in us during training. Skill up. <laughs> Kill. Oh, I, thought, I swear to God. Kill, Kill you. It yes! Oh, that's the awesome. Why must we fight, brother? Yeah, like, Please. Nope, it's all I don't want to hurt you. <laughs> Q. Key up. Oh, you fuck! Uh, uh. I'm done. Right. Goodbye. <laughs> you came out. <laughs> I'm coming with you. I'm so close to fire. As soon as I saw that, I'm thinking like, is this bonus stage? <laughs> and now we fight. Oh, cool it, cool it. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> <laughs> do that fucking <laughs> Acme Looney Tunes shit to him. Everyone knows the classic uh, rivalry between Dark Shinobi and regular Shinobi. Between Dark Shinobi and uh, the Cliff. Here comes, <laughs> here comes the Acme Ninjas. Got them on sale. You can tell. Yeah. Oh, we got parries! Watch out now! You can basically do everything. Revengeance! Get over here. Hurry up. So I could I could I could wait just as long as you can. <laughs> and so the battle of patience has now begun. Oh now god. You can't kill him with it though. Oh that's a certain amount of help. Be the best if you could. And then it goes into a cutscene and it goes into a fatality. Is that all he can do? Basically! Okay, now I gotta fight him. Unless there's like another boss battle with him yeah. later. I do. <laughs> Bye! Let's see if we can back. I'm here! I just needed a breather. Well. Got him. <laughs> ah, I should have tated him. Tatated him. Or whatever the fuck. Sauteed? <laughs> oh, look, he's got the Millennium Eye right on his belt! <laughs> <laughs> it's the source of his power. There you go, I've awakened the sword, idiot. <laughs> so long, dirtbag. Oh, Hatsuma boy. I must go. For my tune copter has arrived. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> we too enjoyed the Matrix. <laughs> They really did underbake these cutscenes. <laughs> he could have cut it in half or something. <laughs> nah, I'm just gonna do a basic vault over. Don't no, worry about it. Revenge is in another couple of years. We're 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 ninjas. We don't like to use. We don't like to waste movement. 